Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello everyone, welcome back to Freaked Fun channel Today I'm going to create a cone shape Okay, now with the cone uh, I will create on at the bottom the elliptic shape and the circle on top so let's go to party side to create sketch now create body create sketch and go to the xy plan okay now i am going to create a lip now first for the guidance line I will create the horizontal line and place on the middle so click this uh, dot and the second dot and the dot on the coordinate system and go to the symmetrical constraint okay now the line in the middle of the uh, coordinate system now create the dimension let's see for the constraint of dimension i will create for 450 millimeter okay Now I'm going to create the vertical line for the guidance of ellipse. Here it is. Now same method. I'm going to create the line in the middle of the coordinate center. So click this point second point and the point on the coordinate system and create symmetrical okay now go to dimension click this line and the vertical dimension for the size 350 millimeter okay now the guideline already finished now I'm going to create the ellip now go to this icon for the ellip by center major and radius okay now click the center now click the horizontal point choose the left or the right i'm going to create the in the right point now for the vertical i'm going to click on the top of the point okay now the ellipse is created so for the line guidance i'm going to make it blue or the shadow line so click this line and create the shadow okay and this line also for the construction geometry or i call shadow okay now the sketch is created we'll uh, make it fully constrained or gear so we'll click this point and this coordinate system and make it online so the ellipse now is green now we can close the sketch so the sketch i will click this and the here we go the sketch 
now this is from the I will show the origin okay now I will hide another axis set or maybe a plane this plane and this plane okay now I'm going to create plan using this plan or we call it datum plan okay now go to the reference let's see click this plan now go to the z direction for the distance 450 millimeter enter now here we go the new plan okay now click this plane and go to sketch now we can create circle use the circle sketch click in the center of the axis okay now stop and click the circle let's create for the radius 175 okay this case screen now we can close now see we have the two sketch in the different plane okay for the bottom it's a L shape and on the top circle shape now we can go to part walk page and then go to the loft to connect between these two sketch now click loft so i'm going to move the sketch first the ellipse okay and then second the circle now I want this to be surface okay now we can click OK so now we can hide the origin and the plan also I want to hide sketch now we can see the cone with the different shape sketch okay now next I want to create how to unfold this surface so we can go to the workbench of the mesh design and then click the surface to unfold and go to mesh now we can click unwrap face the unwrap face only available on the FreeCAD 0.20 or the version development Okay, click again the surface and then see the mesh and click unwrap face okay now waiting for the process ok 
Okay, now so we have the unfold flatten of the scone. See that the different uh, arcs between in the back and in the front. Maybe this looks similar. So to make it more clearly, I will uh, create a smaller circle. Let's see, I want to go to sketch. I will show and then edit and I will uh, change the size from 175 to maybe 80 ok now close the sketch ok now this looks very different on top and on the bottom let's hide this shape and we create so now we go back to workbench mesh design for the new unfold we can click this surface and then go to mesh and on rough face again okay let's see the process okay now the unfold flatten for the cone is already created let's see i want to compare the unfold between this and before show click this shape and show see now the difference between uh, before the circle is big large and now the circle on the top is for the radius 80 millimeter before this radius 175 so I will hide now okay let's see I want to create this for the appearance let's make it orange okay okay so everyone i'll show you how to create the unfold from the cone with the different shape one is circle and one is ellipse i hope it will help you to practice create uh, the cone and also this is uh, I'm not using for the sheet metal but I use surface okay I will end this exercise thank you very much wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh